Hey, it's Dan, and today we're gonna to talk about some red light therapy facts. First of all, you know red light therapy is the hottest modality in the health and wellness industry. It's non-invasive, it's a healing modality. So here's some facts about red light therapy. Human beings need light for health. We all need light for health. Matter of fact, there's a term called malillumination, which means we don't get enough light. Oftentimes we get fatigued, we get depressed, we don't have enough cell generation. It, we just don't do, our body doesn't function the best that it can. 95% of humans do not get enough light. I mean, think about it, we're indoors all the time. Now in the past, we used to get natural light from the sun. So red light is a natural light from the sun spectrum. And red light, we used to get it in the mornings when we get up or working outside or in the evenings by the campfire. Uh, but of course, today's life is much, much different and 95% of Americans don't get enough red light. So we have over 37 trillion cells in our body and each one of those cells contains what's called mitochondria, which is the powerhouse of your cell. Now you probably remember from biology class that the mitochondria actually creates the ATP, which is the energy source for your body, the energy source for your cell, right? So we're gonna talk about that in a minute. But the mitochondria is considered the powerhouse of your cell. That's where all the energy is made. Now, let's talk about light penetration, right? You've heard of blue lights, there's all types of lights. Blue light's really great for acne, uh, penetrates the skin uh, two to three millimeters. Red light, which is the light we're talking about, eight to 10 millimeters penetrates the skin. And near infrared light, 20 to 100 millimeters. Now, let's see here. The human eye can see 400 to 700 nanometers, which is a different measurement tool, but the human eye can see 400 to 700 nanometers. Red light is 620 to 700 nanometers, so we can see red light. When you look at the Ovation ULT red light therapy bed, you can see the diodes all on the bed. You can see the red diodes, and there's some other diodes that look like they're not working, but they are working. They're infrared light. Infrared light is 700 to 10,000 nanometers, and you can see we can only see 400 to 700, so we're not able to see the infrared light. But here's the spectrums. Red light, 620 to 700 nanometers. Near infrared light, 700 to 1400 nanometers. Infrared light, 700 to 10,000 nanometers. Now, here is your biology lesson for today. Very rudimentary, but I wanna share it with you. This is a cell, 37 trillion of these cells in your body. Inside of each cell are mitochondria. And if it's a muscle cell, you might have a thousand mitochondria in each cell. Now, when the red light hits the cell, it actually has some type of photon that triggers the mitochondria to process and release ATP, which is the energy for the source. Now, I'm gonna get into that a little later, get into the how it works. But just for today's video, you know that the mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell and the red light literally activates the ATP inside of your cell within the mitochondria to release energy. And that is the magic of red light therapy. So with the Ovation ULT, the industry leading red light therapy bed, we are seeing wellness centers and spas not only help so many people heal, but create a profit center for their business and create raving fans as they come in for treatments that are non-invasive and no side effects. Red light therapy, you gotta give it a shot, it's for everyone. If you'd like more information about red light therapy, feel free to email me at dlear at bodybalancesystem.com. That's dlear at bodybalancesystem.com. Make it a great week.